significant earthquakes of magnitude 5 or more occur around the globe. They cause a lot of devastation and it's very, very hard to predict as to when and where the next earthquake could happen. But finally, humans may get a somewhat of an early warning system against these killer quakes. Now, Google is in the process of testing an Android-based warning system that will turn your phone into a mini seismograph. This report tells you more. Humans have no answer to nature's fury. Thousands of people perish every year due to earthquakes. But now we may finally get a crucial early warning system. Google's Android phones will soon start detecting earthquakes around the world. These smartphones will provide crucial data that could eventually give billions of users precious seconds of warning to save their lives. So there's hundreds of millions of people around the world that live near earthquake fault zones. Uh, and every few seconds of notice that, that you can receive can give you time uh, to you know, get off of a ladder or move away from a dangerous object and overall take cover. So if you can get early notice that an earthquake is coming towards you, you can protect yourself. And that's an area where we think Android can help. More than 2.5 billion Android devices around the world run Google's Android operating system. These devices will use accelerometers, sensors that measure direction and force of motion to detect earthquakes. It will only be functional when the device is charging, stationary and has user permission to share data with Google. Some users may get up to a minute of notice. Now, as an earthquake starts to propagate, the phones that are closest to the epicenter, they feel shaking and send a signal to the Google Earthquake Detection Server along with a course location of where shaking is happening. We then aggregate data from many phones to determine if an earthquake is happening and how big it is. People expected to experience strong earthquakes would hear a loud alarm and see a full screen warning to drop to the floor, find cover and hold on. Alerts will trigger for significant earthquakes of magnitude 4.5 or more. One of the things that's very interesting about the approach that Google's using is what we call bi-level alerting, where there's two kinds of messages, what is called a be aware message and then a take action message. And that has a lot of implications. That's a type of alerting that we haven't seen done yet. Every year, the world is rocked by thousands of significant earthquakes. More than 1,500 quakes over magnitude 5 have struck every year for the past decade. Since the turn of the century, the deadliest year has been 2004. Close to 300,000 people died, almost 230,000 of them perished in the aftermath of the Indian Ocean earthquake and tsunami. A few years later, more than 2 lakh people were killed in the Haiti earthquake. An early warning system could have saved thousands of lives. This is, this is unique. This is something very new, which, of course, is also very interesting from a lot of different perspectives. But beyond being interesting and beyond being innovative, if it's successful in protecting people, then it is a success. Google expects to issue its first alerts based on accelerometer readings next year. It also plans to feed alerts for free to businesses that want to automatically shut off elevators, gas lines and other systems before the shaking starts. However, the system will not work in China, which has blocked Google's Play Services software.